Officials say about a dozen people were turned away here in line thinking that they could vote. You can, however, go inside and show your ID card to find your correct polling location. Once you head to the correct spot, make sure you bring a valid photo ID with the signature. If you don't have one, you may still be able to vote. Here's how. If you don't have ID or we can't find you on our system, you can vote a regular ballot. We put it in an envelope and we ask you to sign a certificate. Then we bring it back to our office. We verify that you're registered to vote and you didn't vote in any other manner. You went to your assigned polling location. If all that checks out, the canvassing board reviews it and we can open that envelope and count your ballot. Remember, voters are allowed up to three copies of their ballot, so it's okay to make a mistake. Just ask the person in charge of your polling location and they can issue a new ballot. Make sure that you can bring your sample ballot as well to make this whole process a little bit smoother. Reporting from the Elections Office in Palm Beach County, Anthony Costura, WPBF 25 News.